Hey everybody, Hobby Bobby here. Uh, today I want to show you my Brassavola Jiminy Cricket Superbug. Brassavola Jiminy Cricket Superbug. I bought this plant five to six years ago and it was about this size and it's grown so substantially that it grown it grown to the point where you couldn't even see this pot anymore. The roots were just consuming the pot. Uh, should have repotted it or put it in a basket a long time ago, but I didn't. So today, what I did was I took a couple of divisions and I mounted it. So we now have a mounting of Brassavola Jiminy Cricket Superbug on this piece of cork, on this cork bark. So I found a spot on the cork bark that I thought would be good. The plant should grow in this direction. I would have ideally liked to have mounted it slightly higher, but uh, there was kind of a little shelf, so to speak, where I put it. So I put it there and ended up looking good. I think it looks good. We'll see how it does. It's tied on there with fishing wire. And here is my other division and my other mount. Let me zoom out a little bit so you can see it. Uh, it's going to grow to the left, but look at all those roots. Now I tied this on with some fishing line. But then I ran out of fishing line, so I took a copper wire and I just tied it on with that until it uh, takes root. I also threw a little uh, sphagnum moss on both of those just to kind of uh, keep some moisture nearby. I soaked both pieces of bark, whoops, and then I mounted them. And we'll see how they do. They're in here in the orchid tent now. And I just wanted to give you a quick look at that, uh, you know, what was one plant has now become three. And with the way this thing grows... I'm hoping that uh, we'll have two really nice specimens and we'll have uh, the opportunity to see some great flowers coming off of these, these two mounted specimens. All right, have a great day. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. This is Hobby Bobby. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.